Hello, welcome to Studio Pixel. This is the 11th chapter of Volkswagen car modeling in Maya. So, continue from the 10th chapter, we'll uh, concentrate on the front door creation. And here I'll just uh, uh, create the final look of the front door and make the, all the details that we have. So, uh, I need to be sure that uh, my designs is going absolutely fine. Uh, reference. So, just uh, create the cuts uh, here manually so that I can continue the loops so just uh, select those extra cuts and delete them and then use the split polygon tool to create the cut okay. again this portion is need to be taken care of because this portion uh, will be slightly separated This door part, because there is a this is the door uh, area which which will open. So give some supporting cut and every time you you add something, you just have to be very sure and just put this thing uh, detachable. Make uh, both different and now I have I will just uh, adjust this part which is the part of front door which is not exactly connected but it is a part of the front door so just we adjust the vertexes according to my design set fine so this part will be connected with the body of the car and I'll just uh, Combine those. Cool. Just continue those cards according to my flow. I have to be a little bit calculative uh, regarding the new cards. I just create those uh, cards and delay the extra cards or maintain the cut cut flow over there. Need two more. Uh, slide those cuts. Cool. So now I can uh, mars the. Just a bit. Uh, sorry. And slide those edges. And need the supportive cuts to maintain the continuation of the cuts. You have to be very cautious about your cut flow because that is the most important thing. Delete those. I don't need them right now. Whenever you need to continue the cut flow, feel free to add the cuts required, which is the undesirable. And now to merge the vertices. Snap with them first, then merge the vertices. Or you can use the Marge vertex tool. I need another cut over here. Just to march them. Fine. Now this is a part of this uh, uh, body. Here's a tent happening. Let's see. Just uh, delete the history. And just unhide the rest of the geometry and you need to uh, readjust the vertices I previously created those I don't need them let's delete them fine now these are the uh, this is the window part cool so just make, make sure the base uh, vertex are in the same level and I'll start the detailing of the Door. Just make sure my uh, window is in, in good position. So select those outer parts and extrude them inside to create this window. 
fine. Now you have to adjust those uh, vertex according to your uh, door. Just push them back or back and forth to maintain the shape of the window. So just uh, select and isolate the selection so I can do the adjustments. Giving the supporting cuts is very important. Fine. While you you're working on the perspective, you need to uh, do it in a different angle so that your models is uh, models are got the shape right shape from from different views. That will help a lot. Okay, now uh, I have got my uh, basic shape of the window and the uh, base of the window. Just uh, rematch the sorry, rematch the unsmooth models, so it will uh, definitely just I need to uh, reshape this uh, <coughs> outer part slide. We are just the supportive. Oops, there is a problem. And uh, just make some mess out there. Uh, I need to adjust this. Oops. Uh, let me see. I think I have to recreate this area. Just uh, giving giving it a try. It just uh, rescale the outline. Okay, that will help it out. Nope. Okay, and just uh, no, it's not. I, mean, I think it should it should delay this. Uh, delete the portion. It's something that definitely I messed it up over there cool now I have to okay just delay those extra yes there are some extra cuts so just convert selection to face and just delay those Also, these parts. I'll just recreate because uh, this is too much confusion happening over there. Fine. Now this is uh, this uh, geometry is a bit uh, finer. So just uh, put a cut over here. Just like this. Fine. So that's how I can create that uh, four-sided, and I'll just extrude these edges and merge those vertices. Sometimes you have to recreate few parts as you if you messed up. That's it's highly recommended if you cannot handle those for by editing. So I'm just selecting the edges and extrude and merge those vertices. And now here I have to create that post uh, so uh, just to which is the base of that uh, screen or the weird screen to view the side views which is uh, okay, which cars or any any vehicles coming from 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 behind on the side sorry so just create and select those faces extrude and just uh, delete those interfaces and select and merge vertex tool and merge them. 
fine. So now it's a uh, the base of the door. It's I mean the, the door structure is almost done. Just create some uh, supportive cuts to maintain the shape. Just to maintain the corner area, just uh, create some vertex and just put them so that I can create the exact shape of it. Just uh, make sure scaling is perfect and the uh, uh, supportive cut of the corners are very good. So that's it. It's uh, it's almost there. Just I have to. Uh, we adjust those uh, edges of the screen and just make it short. So, just give it an inner <coughs> cut and just pull it up. Something fine. Now, detailing it's, uh, it's uh, on almost unlimited options, unlimited uh, possibilities are out there. So, it's uh, right. Fine, it's done. So I'll just uh, leave it over here in this chapter. So hope you enjoy this. Thank you very much.